Hey everybody, how's it going? Scott Sprontzer here, DocSports.com with our NFL update for Saturday, January 11th, 2020. We've got, of course, the divisional round of the playoffs. We're going to talk about one of those games in just a moment. Also give you a prop on another game. All that coming up in just a second. First quick note, if you've yet to uh, jump on board and grab the football packages over at DocSports.com, you can get them this week, 50% off. Simple as that. 50% off the football package. Here's what I got going this week. I've got three plays in the divisional round, including a top play, a seven-star play. And then I've got a five-star in the college football Monday night championship game between Clemson and LSU. All four games in one package, and it's 50% off this week in football at DocSports.com. And don't forget about the $60 free account. If you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, click on the link below this video. Get set up for a free $60 account. Use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages or anybody else on the roster over at DocSports.com. It is as simple as that. All right, we head into Saturday's action, and I'll get to the free pick in tonight's football in just a moment. Uh, first, a quick note. We have, again, all the football plays available right now, DocSports.com. Four plays, three from the NFL and the Monday Night College Football Championship in one package. I've also got a multi-game card in college baskets on Saturday. We are on a 20 wins, nine loss, one push run, 69% with our last 30 plays in college basketball got a seven star play at the top of the card for saturday that'll be available at 11 30 a.m eastern 8 30 a.m pacific nfl nhl excuse me nhl nba will be available at 1 p.m eastern 10 a.m pacific the football package is available right now even if you're watching these on friday evening so that's what's going on for us over at docsports.com by the way in the nfl and college football the last 11 weeks now going into our 12th week we are 59 percent against the spread that's over 80 plays college football and NFL combined. Don't miss out on this week's card. Don't miss out on Saturday's college baskets. Seven-star play leading the way. I'm going to get to the free pick on the game itself in just a moment. I want to tell you where the betting report is, and then we're going to talk about a prop also. But as far as the betting report is concerned, Minnesota-San Francisco, uh, that game currently San Francisco, again, land about seven. Looking at uh, tickets at about 50-50 at this point in some books. Uh, the money still a little bit more on Minnesota right now, about 52-53% of the money on the Vikings. Tennessee-Baltimore, well, Baltimore, as you can imagine, getting a little bit more than half the tickets, a little bit more than half the money. They're around 53% in both of those categories. And then, of course, on Sunday, you got Houston and Kansas City. KC laying nine, nine and a half in that one. Uh, the Chiefs getting about uh, 52, 53% of the tickets. They're getting upwards of 60% of the money. And the late game on Sunday, Seattle and Green Bay, where Green Bay is up to four and a half. And right now, though, you're looking at, uh, oh, 55, 56% of the tickets in most joints on Seattle. Even the money has come in a little bit on Seattle in this one. Uh, but Green Bay, again, a four and a half point favorite in that contest. I uh, wanted to mention the prop that I was thinking about before uh, we get to the free pick in the actual game. And the prop's actually from Sunday's NFL action. It's the matchup between uh, Houston and Kansas City. Excuse me, between Seattle and Green Bay. And uh, I, I really like Russell Wilson to run for more uh, than 28 yards. And this total, this number, uh, has gone up a little bit as far as the yardage number. It was around 25, 26. It's up to 28. Still like it. But I think you got to get out in front of it now because I still think there's a chance it could go up a little bit. So wanted to give it to you today, even though the game is on Sunday. And I will have a free pick video talking about Sunday's card posted by 10 p.m. Pacific on Saturday night for Sunday. But I wanted to get out in front of that prop and just in case it goes up at all from where it is now sitting at 28. And again, we like Russell Wilson over 28 yards rushing. And uh, really, has nobody behind him but a bunch of banged up running backs so he's probably gonna have to take off with the football a couple of times in that game against Green Bay and we'd like him to go over the posted total uh, here is our official free pick uh, for Saturday's football it's the matchup between the Titans and the Ravens total sitting at 47 like the under in this game guys when you look at this we've got two run based offenses uh, the Titans have played a better brand of football obviously with Tannehill since he replaced Mariota but if you look at he at Tannehill Hill in this offense since he's been starting since the bye week. They've played the Colts, the Jaguars, the Raiders. In week 17, they took on a Houston Texans team 
the game meant nothing to Houston. They approached it like an exhibition game. And then last week, they took on a good defense when they faced New England, and Tannehill did nothing. I mean, the team scored six points in the second half. Tannehill goes eight for 15, 72, 73 yards. A quarterback rating of 61. He threw a touchdown pass. He threw a horrible interception. Just not a good game for the offense or for Tannehill. They were fortunate uh, that the Patriots had nobody to stretch the field on their offensive side of the football. They probably would have won that game. Uh, but again, not completely sold on Tannehill. Yeah, he's better for this team than Mariota. He's got the stronger arm. He can hit those throws outside the numbers. But we think Baltimore is going to be ready for him here. So do believe that Tennessee is going to have to run the football. They got the big boy to do that with. And as far as Baltimore, I think you're going to see more of a run-based offense throughout a good chunk of this game. So I think the game moves quick, and we see under 47 in this contest. Certainly doesn't hurt our feelings that we're hearing about uh, high winds of 15 miles per hour or more moving in during the course of this game for the second half. And at 15 miles per hour and above, that's where coaches start to sub in for running plays rather than passing plays when you got a 50-50 spot of a run or pass selection. So we're going to play the under. We're going to recommend that under 47 uh, between the Tennessee Titans and the Baltimore Ravens are free pick. All right, listen, if you like these videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I do appreciate those who have done so thus far. We'll be right back here with our next video for Sunday's football, 10 p.m. Pacific on Saturday night. So be sure uh, to check that one out. All right, that's going to do it for us. Let's put Saturday in the win column right back here, late Saturday night, early Sunday morning with our next free pick.